Peace be with you. Welcome back to my channel for another video, another intuitive spiritual download. If this is the first time that you are coming across my channel, welcome. Maybe you were invited by a friend. Maybe you just were scrolling and you said, hmm, maybe I'll click on this video. And here you are. It's not by coincidence. Nine times out of 10, you already know what's going to happen in the reading a lot of it's going to resonate or maybe some of it won't. And if it doesn't, that's okay. Just leave it for somebody else to take. Leave what? The energy, the reading, the details, right? For somebody else to apply to their situation. If you are returning back to the channel, you are my beautiful, amazing soul tribe family. I'm coming in to support you in the energy. High frequency. I love you and you love me. We are beautiful, happy soul tribe family. Soul tribe, soul tribe, soul tribe, soul tribe, soul tribe, soul tribe. Listen, I love y'all so freaking much. Come on in here and get to this spiritual work. Baby, honey, listen, the ethers are talking. There's a lot going on. I've already called in my appropriate protection. I pray that you were wise enough to have done the same. Holy Spirit, angels, what is it that we need to see? The Queen of Cups is coming out first. Psychic and or intuition. To me, when I see the Queen of Cups, this is just as good, in my opinion, energetically at least. As the high priestess, they're so comparable by way of energy, psychic, intuitive, okay? Nurturing, caring, loving, kind, feminine, absolutely divine feminine energy, healers, okay? Yeah, listen, star energy, the healing era, <laughs> age of Aquarius, the age of the great awakening, the star, hope, optimism, love, peace, new opportunities, creativity, astral creativity, spiritual creativity, co-creating with the co-creator, with the creator of all things, king of swords, wise and intuitive, Aquarius, Gemini, and or Libran energy, okay? This is some good high vibrational energy, king of swords, Aquarius, come on, wise, intuitive, a Gemini, very communicative, right? Speaking to Mercury retrograde, understanding Oh, yeah. Understanding the universal language I just heard by way of that Queen of Cups psychic. The stars. It's written in the stars, y'all. Listen, divine intervention as opposed to the beast in the field. I can't make it up. El Diablo is the earth. El Diablo is the world. Clarify, please, and thank you. What is it that we need to see? Clarify that devil. That devil is wounded, honey. That darkness has nowhere to go. That hatred, that fighting, that chaos, all that dark ass energy. It has nowhere to go with the Knight of Wands. We're protected. Clarify the star and the Queen of Cups. Yeah, listen. When I said that we were protected, that means that we cannot be sacrificed. Hangman situation for the devil is hanging the devil upside down by his pinky toe. Like, look, let's just have a real conversation. You know, it's like the creator saying, oh, you know, dark devils, where have you been? What have you been up to? <laughs> oh, we've, we've just been going around and seeing who we can devour and hurt. And okay. And they felt as though they were useful to some extent. Now with all this love, y'all, and light, listen, clarify, I can't make it up. We're protecting the family. We're protecting the world with good energy, not feeding into the illusions, okay? Seven of Wands, right in the middle of an election, protecting the soul, tribe, family, Ten of Cups, I can't make it up. Seven of Wands is ancestors. Ten of Cups is lineage, bloodline, soul tribe, family, energy. Seven of Pentacles is Akashic Records. Okay? Everything's been recorded. Everything is recorded. This is your lineage. I cannot make it up. The Ten of Pentacles represents the Ten of Motherfucking Pentacles. Legacy, inheritance, culmination, dedication, creativity, innovation, compassion, intuition, Head over heart decisions, discipline, 
truth, sacrifice, perspective, release, and disengagement, knowing when to disengage from toxic, demonic-ass relationships. Even if that one relationship is you breaking up with the toxic-ass version of yourself, then do it. The addiction, codependency, the wounded energy, victimized energy, the woe is me energy. Listen, come on now. Sometimes I got something like spiritual bars. Happy to have a commercial break in the middle of all the commercial breaks. Listen, four of pentacles, okay? Represents conservation, security, holding on to the gift. Seven of swords. This sneaky dark energy has been transmuted and it is, will be, and soon to be transmuted permanently out of the ethers. I promise you, the world is awakening to beauty, love, and light. Moving forward is a victory, okay? This is the way that the future is being created. Nobody wants to hear it. It's the people that want to stay in conflict. Five of wands, they want to create wars and then have rumors of wars. Then put it in the media or whatever the hell they got going on. We know the universal laws. And the universal law says that the earth is saying, the stars are saying, the universe is saying, the higher ups, everything in existence is saying that this is direct lineage to divinity in the earth. The heavens and the earth, as above, so below, like, yeah, my whole bloodline is free. Okay, all right, well, they don't believe it, but we'll see what happens. They keep going into the light, okay? The teachers, the gurus, the poor righteous teachers, and by way of poor, I do not mean by way of worldly possessions. Poor as in meek, humble, okay? You just are, you just are light. So you're channeling more of that. Being patient with people that are hurting in this demonic ass energy. However, the cycle for that, let's just clarify, is over. I can't make the shit up. Did I not just say there was a time that we were patient with that energy? Now we are totally living without it and we are imagining it collectively together. We're imagining that it doesn't exist. And so it doesn't. And so now the devil's hanging up by his toe. So now you're leaving people that are like other people to fight one another if that's what they want to do they're going to naturally isolate themselves in one group where there's conflict because they don't know how to get out of the conflict hmm like i said the time for that is over we've transformed transmuted transformed <laughs> allow that energy to die and have it do what it do or whatever it was, okay? In the heavens and the earth, earth sign energy in the heavens and the earth and the Holy Spirits with the air sign energy, queen of swords, mental. Your heart is your mind. Your mind is your heart. Listen, intuition, discernment, king of pentacles is Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn energy. Taurus represents, you know, the, the throat chakra. What is communicated into the atmosphere? What are you speaking in the earth that the wind is going to take your request by way of the universe yeah every time you speak you are placing an order be that good bad or indifferent right one should be seeking to stay in a high vibration because there's something good going on in the future and it looks really really good there's a lot of awakened people too many that the universe is going to allow these people that want to stay in this little tiny space of competition and bullshit to stick to stay awake i mean it's like they, if, if they want to stay there now with all the information that we have by way of being awakened in the great awakening in the age of Aquarius and they continue to want to stay asleep, then there's nothing we can do. They're just going to watch Queen of Wands. is like, you know, the warrior, you know, going to battle very silently, very eloquently, though, very naturally eliminating that which no longer serves in a high vibration because there's too many people that outrank that energy. The light is too bright. Just one speck of light is too bright for all their darkness. It just ain't going to work. Okay? So they're absolutely getting information, page of swords, watching, spying, talking, having conversations, trying to figure out what's going on. Again, some of them are trying to determine where we're from. A lot of them are going on some type of a journey. They don't know where, whoever they are. These are people that wanted to be bound to toxicity. Unfortunately. Okay, but even still, there's a greater better of people that are giving a good example of what love and light looks like. And it's all colors, right? Okay. So that in itself is saying there's there is some form of a victory, the high priestess. Go ahead, baby. 
Just make sure you clean up the, the counters. Okay, thank you. The high priestess, listen. Intuition, third eye open. Okay, never doubting your power, knowing that what you feel is true. Listen, shit's over. I mean, you know, it is what it is. Five of Pentacles is leaving people out in the cold, intuitively knowing who to leave out in the cold. And it's okay because it's bittersweet. For some people, you know, you just had your time with them. It's not bad. You wish them a fair bid well. You had a beautiful game of equal give and take for however long you were supposed to. And now you have to go about this journey intuitively. Listen, Ace of Cups is a brand new beginning, a brand new life, a brand new uh, existence, uh, you know impenetrable light direct connection really walking in that god love energy you know it's making the trees grow <laughs> it's cleansing the waters the oceans just because we're in this high vibration it's making the animals happy yeah listen working in the earth tending to the earth okay taking dominion over the earth toiling labor being about our father's work in the earth ace of cups to the eight of pentacles this is divine work with the high priestess, this is divine work. That's what that means. Heavy is the head that wears the crown. Everybody wanted to be the empress. Everybody wanted to be the high priestess. Everybody wanted to be a divine masculine baby. They had the dress down pack. They were rocking all of whatever they thought a divine feminine looked like. Okay. But what was going on on the inside is what put these relationships to death. We had to separate ourselves from this energy. And the great part about it is there's not that many people that are dark right now. I'm going to be honest with you. There's still a great deal of people that are dark. But for the most part, we women. It's a lot of divine beings that are awakened. <laughs> that are coming into the realization like, yeah, this is some bullshit. Listen. Like already in the future, paving the way for destiny, ten of cups, yeah, ten of pentacles. We're talking about eternal divine connection, never to be asleep again, you know, to the world standards of whoever this guy is, El Diablo put some laws in place and then everybody went crazy and competition and jealousy and hatred. Like, what is that? Two of pentacles. Listen, I keep saying that the earth is spinning on her axle. Why? Because things have to come into balance. So when you hear about a tsunami in California, then you gonna know that it was justice by way of spiritual law, okay? By way of karma, by way of my eyes spinning the block and causing a tsunami. Okay, well, they don't believe it until it happens, you know? They called us crazy until we were right, but then we came with the light and we brought the truth. With, with the sun, with illumination, with enlightenment is truth. The sun, we put the light on things that were hidden. Listen, it's like, hey, wake up. Okay, hi, wake up. Hi there. Are you conscious that you're conscious? Okay, well, maybe you are, maybe you aren't. Whatever you decide to do is totally up to you. Just know you got free will. But wishes are being fulfilled all over the world. And one thing we know is that once we close the door, nobody can open that door back up. The world, listen. <laughs> Them cycles are done, son stick a fork in it it's done boo can we just have a commercial break listen let me tell you the truth there's so much awakened family soul tribe energy right here that that light that we're generating is literally dismantling destroying or has already destroyed satan's camp it's already done there's nothing like I'm like, there's nothing light. Love is what dismantled that. When, when, when I clarify, what else do we have to do in this cycle before the world, you know, number 21 gatekeeper before that gate, that door, that portal, that time, that, 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 that parallel line now that will never intersect with me. Now that that cycle's closed and I ask to clarify death it's over ending. To fini, but to every ending, there is a new beginning. If you're fortunate, okay, they will never be on a line with you that intersects by way of energy. Why? Because they put themselves in a parallel existence. You saw the glass is half full. They saw it as half empty. Two completely different views, and that's okay. We are not the same. Listen, 
But these worlds and these doors to these worlds to these people had to be closed. Okay, again, they still want chaos. They still want, you know, uh, disharmony. Yeah, look, two of cups in the reverse. It's a hell to the no. We're turning down the offer. We're like, no, no, we're good. Okay, no, it's fine. Listen, <laughs> we got to protect what this good energy is because the future depends on it. In so many ways, the future depends on it. They wanted to partner up. They still do. Okay. But the future absolutely does depend on what we do now. And so we understand that. So going backwards is not an option. Okay. It's not an option. It's about standing up. And that's what we're doing energetically. The enemy's been defeated. They're fighting themselves, not a swords in the reverse. It's like a defeated battle. Five of wands, competition, jealousy. We don't understand it no more. Racism, hatred, whatever the hell. Okay, yeah, listen. At some point, we got to just figure it out as a human being, right? We have to. We have to. And this is where we're at. So these people don't have a leg to stand on. <laughs> Getting back to the reading, keeping it a buck. Listen, they don't, they don't have a leg to stand on. Listen, mama earth, fire. That's all kinds of stuff going on. You're going to hear about all kinds of shit around the world. Betrayals, scandals, whistleblowers. This person now going to tell on them. Everybody's exposing everybody. There is no loyalty amongst liars and thieves. And this is why Satan's camp is upset. So the more that we put out that good energy, the more exposed certain things get. Okay. Ten of wands at the bottom of the deck. Okay. Weighed down. Heavy situations. Because there's a shift in energy. Okay, like people thought it was a joke when we said everybody can't go. See this boat sailing to calmer waters? It's not going to fit everybody. It's only for people that are really, really, truly in alignment with what the universe is trying to bring into alignment and will bring into alignment, which is the nine of cups, ten of cups. Family, listen, they know this though. Somebody knows that they're being permanently control alt deleted out of the universe. What does that mean? Up until this point, everything's been in a pattern. This is why we got the deja vus, right? So you had people that wanted to keep those cycles open. They didn't want to come into the light. This is why they're looking like this. Nine of swords, stressed, depressed, ten of swords, crazy. Right? Now that we've exposed a lot by way of what we're doing, These people have to deal with the fact of what they did in the dark. There's too much light on the planet illuminating these dark deeds. And this is why you're watching certain things just fall and go asunder. Headed for a government list, you know, government list, like no government type of an energy. You got people that are so high ranked by way of energy, they're governing themselves and they're being respectful. Yeah, listen, breaking free from these uh, self-imposed imprisonments. Eight of swords, why? Because judgment is here. That's why. And this is what has the ops weighed down. Okay, well, listen. This is what the ether's news is. This is what's going on in these uh, galactic being meetings. So you think about people on other planets, you think about other human life or alien life or whatever. What are they discussing? This. <laughs> this is what they're discussing. Exactly. <laughs> Judgment. And so now your neighbor has to come over and be your neighbor and say, won't you be my neighbor? Listen, now the pentacles coming over with a little break room. Okay. Won't you be my friend? Do you want to go to the park? My friend, listen. I know talk to you before, but I want to talk to you because you got the ace of pentacles. The pentacle is pentaclesing. Nobody can deny that. Okay. Nobody can negate that. And even if they tried, they'd be sitting in a state of confusion because that breadcrumb is just a breadcrumb at the end of the day, top of the morning, middle of the morning, whatever. Okay. Somebody has to make a decision. To a source is free will. Okay. Yeah. You either heal or you stay in this darkness. Deal with your heart. This is why my eye is spinning the block so quick. She got a whole bunch of scales. As above, so below with the magician. 
She's got a whole bunch of scales. She's wearing, she's wearing the scales by way of weighing the hearts to see if they're as light as a feather. Are you adhering to the laws? As above, so below, divine intervention. Okay, because there's too much light here. There's too many people now that are going into the light, wanting a peaceful life, wanting peace on earth. And so now these people that are bound to whatever darkness and the shadow or whatever they got going on dealing with their karma, they're a little bit more illuminated because they are the uh, anomaly. They're rare. They're odd. Okay. They, they, they stick out. We're like, oh, you just want to fight for what? Now you got people going around, you know, on social media. Oh, you're toxic. Oh, we're recognizing that now. That's good. Listen, King of Cups, self-love. <laughs> Come on and join us. But so who's going to clean up all that dirt? Who's going to clean up all that karma? The tower. <laughs> 2102, just as I said that. Listen, this is why they're weighed down. This is just checking the ether's news, okay? So somebody could be like, oh, you always say, listen, this is the ether's news. Not my words, but the universe's words. If you have any questions and or concerns, I recommend that you get in contact with the universe and have that conversation <laughs> and figure out where that's coming from. Because I come here to tell you the truth and the truth and the whole truth and nothing but the truth. As far as I am being able to see, so says the creator of all things. As I share my gift here with you, I encourage you to pray over every single reading. Okay. If it's not your story, don't, don't you force it. Don't you take a round circle peg and try to force it into a rectangular shaped peg. <laughs> Listen, don't you Simon says, okay. Don't get in the grinder, okay, little baby. Don't get in the grinder. <laughs> You're in the grinder. I love y'all. Listen, if this resonated with you, this really did make me happy. It does make me happy. I'm so happy to be here with you at this moment, at this time. If you'd like to donate to the channel, go ahead. All my information is down below. I love you so much. If you want to send me love and light, guess what? I'm always going to be open to that. I send it right back to you, love and light. And I will see you in the next video. Until then, peace be with you.